Hey guys and gals, um, wow, today's my first audio commentary for 2016 with my new character, and, um, I just did a video version with the green screen, actually, which I had no plans on getting back on, but, you know what, I won't make a habit out of it too much, I'll be on and off with it, um, but besides that, this is, I'll still do commentary on and off, so, you know, let's leave it as that. Um, I'm going to talk about the movie Lucky Bastard, and, um, this is a movie I can't seen a long time ago, but I just felt like it was hype, and guess what, it is hype, because to me it's bullshit, it's like, seriously, come on, I mean, okay, the acting was good, but still it's bullshit, I mean, uh, it's about this porn production, right, and the guy had a, had a website called Lucky Bastard, when he could hire amateur fans of porn stars to be in the porn movie and fuck their favorite porn stars. You got one porn star, she's like all political and shit, you know what I'm saying? I'm like, oh great, we need porn stars to talk political. They have standards. Just fuck the guy and call it a day. But, um, the scene kind of got mishap when the guy just come real fast and people was making fun of him and the woman don't want to go through with the scene because she felt like that was crazy and stuff. And guess what? The guy was fucking crazy anyway. What makes it this movie, like, really fucking stupid? And if you people like this movie, fuck you. Because this movie is fucking stupid, okay? It's not even an opinion. It's not even... It's just a fact, okay? Alright, you're going to have some amateur guy that you just met on the fucking internet. The fuck... A, a professional porn star. Like, it's not even amateur porn. It's like... You're going to have an amateur guy to be in a professional production without doing a really, really good background check on the guy, you know, and make sure he gets tested. Yeah, I mean, he may have the paperwork, but you know what? Anything could happen behind the scenes outside of the production. Like, shouldn't you have him tested in one day under your watch? I mean, come on, you don't know if he has HIV. Like, you don't know what goes on behind the fucking scenes outside of the porn industry. Fuck it, I know, because... Let's just say I have a bad history myself. But, um, it's, it's, it's like stupid though, man. Anyway, like I say, the guy comes so fast. The girl there doesn't want to go with the porn, in, porn scene with the guy. And she's like telling the boss, like, you know what, I don't want to go through with it. The boss kind of supports her and decided. And, and it's just me just fast forwarding the story because I just want to get to the fucking point. Um, he said, he, the guy, the Asian guy, he told the Asian guy to drive the guy home. And the guy got mad. He wants the hard drive. He wants the tapes pretty much. You know, that's all he wants. But then the guy that cannot get it up for the girl, like he come too fast, um, killed the Asian guy. He said, go back to the house and start killing people and holding people hostage. And it ended up becoming like a home invasion type of thing. And, you know, start torturing people in different ways. Mostly it's gunshots. You get your penis dildo abuse from a from a guy on guy. Um and you know, it just leads up to with the with the stalker guy talking to the porn star one on one at the end of it. And you know, the the movie's just stupid. It's just I don't wanna ruin the ending, but you know, the movie's just stupid and dumb. And um I mean yeah, you have your sex scenes, you have nudity, but it's not like hardcore. I heard the I mean the version I saw was N C seventeen. Um, I saw this online, though. I saw the Blu-ray version. Trust me, like, I'm gonna waste my... M Blu-rays are so fucking expensive. Even DVDs are expensive now. I'm not gonna waste my money on this piece of shit, okay? Fuck that. If I wanna waste my money on this, I just watch real fucking porn, okay? Trust me. And I got a lot of real porn that is really good. You could all just check my porn reviews, you know? Sorry that some of, the, that some of them are incomplete reviews, but, you know, you get the picture, you know? But still, this movie is a fucking garbage. Please see the shit for free by any means necessary. As for the porn star, she was she was alright looking but she wasn't like all that. I mean, come on. Asa Akira? That's all that. That I would rather see her in this fucking movie. I might make an exception. Fuck it. I just might, might fast forward the scenes with her in it only. But anyway, peace guys and see you later.